What happens when you move coherence through your body? Clean, pristine sound, clean, pristine thoughts, uninterrupted, unhindered, is that the dendrites, those are the little filaments at the end of your nerves, are alive again. What happens is the atrophy that occurs with chemistry and trauma and whatever all those words are, we want to open those up, move sound through and create bridging gaps between synapses. So where in a brain or in tissue, there is the ability for this coherence to move through. And we're going to be speaking about energies that we don't have words for in the medical dictionaries. That's are, are part of consciousness. Consciousness moves and flows through the body structures as electromagnetic plasmatic arcing. That's if you want to put one of a thousand definitions, what is healing? Healing is coherent pathways of unimpeded energy forms in infinite freedom so that your tissue is able to grow through that arc and create an extension of you, a creator expanding itself, creating more of self in devotion, a loving devotion of more beauty of me. That's what this is happening when you create coherence through your body. You have new kinds of muscles. And this happens at the cellular mitosis level when cells divide. When you speak to your body, your cells are listening. You are God. God is to that. And the cells say, oh, I don't want to make a copy anymore. I want to make more something new. Anyway, this is where it's happening. And your DNA facilitates that by saying, well, we're going to create a brand new template. So that cell knows the new version of you. And then there's a new structure, a new kind of muscle fiber. And then suddenly you move differently. People who heal are no longer the same human. They can dance and move and walk because the simple act of walking in a new way is creating new thoughts, new energy patterns in your body. You could be 90 and do this.